everyone, Leandra Audios Realtor here with the Rio Rancho Regional Chamber of Commerce for this week's weekly chamber chat. Super excited to have Neil in the studio with us again today. Thanks for coming. Neil is with Rio Rancho Creative Crossroads. You guys have so many exciting things going on. Tell us all about it. Thanks for having us today, Leandra. Um, so yeah, so I'm with Rio Rancho Creative Crossroads and we do community arts programming here in Rio Rancho. So you don't have to go to Albuquerque. We do um, both of the community courses uh, for elementary school age and then for middle and high school. Um, we do uh, some art shows. We have an art show coming up um, April 8th um, at Star Heights and we do workshops and some other things. And our bigger program now is the Rio Rancho Players Community Theater, which is going into its fourth production um, in April. I'm super yeah. excited for you guys. You guys have a new production coming on. What point are you at in that production? Are you looking for cast members? Where are you guys at? We are already um, in rehearsal. And I brought Mel, the director, and I'm going to let him tell you about the play um, here shortly. But I will tell you real quickly that before the play, the weekend before the play, the Saturday before Easter, we have this art show coming up. It's called Art New Mexico. Um, it's a part of Creative New Mexico. They do nine cities. They ask nine cities every year to do these art shows, and this will be the second year that Rio Rancho has been selected. We have about 28 local artists and um, uh, woodworkers and potters and photographers and all sorts of people coming to Star Heights Rec Center, uh, which is kind of right behind Walmart on Polaris Boulevard. And that's from 10 to 1 on the 8th, and that's free. Awesome. Right? For so if admission. You're, and mm -hmm. if you're watching this video today, we're going to give you a link up above where you guys can click it and get all the details right. and information. If you guys want to participate in the course or the theater or any of the fun right. art programs that um, Neil and her team has going on, reach out to them. It's a great opportunity. Let's let Mel come in and tell us a little bit more about the production and the play that's coming up. Fantastic. Thank you. The, uh, this is our fourth production coming up, as Neil mentioned. and. Uh, this play is going to be presented in a completely different style. We are doing it as dessert theater, uh, where, uh, yeah, your patrons come in uh, and they get the opportunity to get a piece of cheesecake and a cup of coffee and sit at a round table and enjoy the play while they're munching on their favorite dessert. Uh, we hope that the desserts are not better than the play is going to be, and, <laughs> and we don't think that that's going to be the case because Absolutely we have not. a very, very exciting play that we're going to be offering to the Rio Rancho community uh, when we open up on April the 14th. And that play is called Airport Encounters, uh, and uh, it's an ensemble play, uh, 12 separate scenes of where uh, people who are getting ready to board an airplane are sitting at the gate, as we all have, waiting to board <laughs> the plane, and it's who they meet and what happens in the interaction with the people that they meet throughout the course of the time that they're waiting to get on the plane. And it, it's a hoot. It really is really kind of funny. <laughs> uh, not kind of funny, it is funny. Uh, some of the scenes are kind of slapstick. Uh, for those of you out there, they're go back that far that remember the Lucille Ball, Desi yes. Arnaz kind of slapstick <laughs> kind of stuff. Well, we're doing a lot of that. Uh, one of the scenes, uh, just real quick, is called The Lizard. And it's a woman who's trying to sneak her pet lizard onto the plane. And uh, uh, the lizard gets loose. Oh, yes, and I won't, of course. I won't, I won't tell you what happens <laughs> after that, but it really is kind of really adorable kind of a scene that happens there. And all of the scenes, for the most part, are really funny and a couple of the scenes are rather poignant as well and uh, we're really excited about it. We have a cast that's uh, close to 25 people and uh, some of them brand new and some of them that have been with us for the first three productions and we continue to grow and we're very excited about it. I'm excited for you guys. It sounds like a lot of fun. I'm going to be going to see that. That sounds very entertaining. And cheesecake. You mentioned cheesecake, so I'm definitely in there. <laughs> yeah, well, there, there you go. I mean, that's the draw. That's one of the draws that's there. And what, what's really nice about it, it's in a very intimate setting. We're uh, performing uh, at St. Francis Episcopal Church, their parish hall theater. And the theater only holds 64 people. So get and, your tickets now. Yes, get your tickets <laughs> now for the eight performances over 
three weekends starting the middle of April, uh, four evenings and four matinees. And what's nice is the audience is really, really almost on top of the actors and actresses. And our actors and actresses really come through the audience as if they're traveling you know, from the restaurant or coming in through security and coming to the gate. And we, our set is set up to look just like a gate that you're waiting to board the plane. So uh, I'm having a lot of fun directing it. Uh, you know, we've done a lot of serious stuff in the past, Our Town and A uh, Little Piece of Heaven and Almost Maine. And this is the first time that we hope that we're really going to get the audience super laughing at what we're doing. And from what I've seen in the rehearsals thus far, I think we're going to be <laughs> You're gonna having nail an it. enjoyable <laughs> evening. That's what we're looking forward to. Awesome. So again, Rio Rancho Creative Crossroads, they're going to be putting on this amazing production. Mel and his team are working hard. I hope you guys are going to get out there to see it. Again, if you're watching the video, we're going to put some links either up above, down below, or over to one of these sites so you can get your tickets right away. Mel, thank you so thank much you. for joining us. We hope that everybody watching today has a wonderful day.